the winner of that. Yeah, again, Gorman. I watched Gorman beat uh, Akin Landing, uh, Christian Palace Leisure Centre. I think it was meant to be the English and it ended up being an IBO, something or other fight. And um, Gorman won every round pretty easy, but it was probably too easy. Yeah. Just took a little left hand again there, Alan. He did, yeah. He's just, he's just labouring, just using his extra weight. It's just been top of him. Nice shot, jab that he just threw there. That's more of the day value. Probably took him a few rounds to shake off, you know. Huge disappointment to box on that big show, oh. the Kelbrook show, and then. Nice right hand there, Frida. Keep jabbing, Dave, come on. Just trying to keep on top of the tweets. That's Hashtag it. MTK on, Boxing on, Live. Darren Downey's tweeted in. Best of luck to the local lad, Kane Horse. Can you just let me know if I'm pronouncing that right? I was going to wait till the MC had a go at saying it. Oh, there you go. Right hand over the top Good there. He's knocked him out. Almost apologetic there, uh, Dave Allen. Straight away, he's waving. Yeah, that was a you know, good referee in that. He's yeah, waved it off straight away. Um, moved him in with the jab and then he threw in the right hand over the top. Nice he shot to finish it. Yeah, I mean, he, he threw it three or four times, just lining it up, and he was, you know, and that time he just he just threw it with a little bit of purpose. Oxygen's never nice to see, the oxygen's coming in now. No, he's sat up and he, he, is, he is responding in there. Yeah. But no, so what was it for... Probably not the ideal time to say, but you know, Dave Allen, I think it's the digs there. You know, he's done what other people are doing to him. You know, Adam McCarg has, has, has stopped, stopped on Dallas, and now Dave Allen's gone in there, and he's got probably the first real shot he let go that was. Yeah, and you know what? You could see he was getting frustrated with labour in his shots, and you know, like you say, it was like it was almost like he was tapping a heavy bag in there, and then he's obviously, like you were saying, and alluded to, he was getting caught a few times inside, and he just let one go. and it's, it was something I think somebody told me, it was when we were talking about the new school for tackling football, if you don't go in properly for a big 50-50, you can come off getting hurt. Mm. If you're going into you know, a heavyweight title fight of any level, pulling your shots, you are done. We're doing Dave. Just, all right, mate, we tried, tried our best to be complimentary about you there, mate. Uh, just pulling your shots a little bit, weren't you? Pulling your shots a little bit. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah, we're, we're, we're live, Dave. What show are you on in September, Dave? You're on the Matchroom show, yeah? 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 Okay, no worries. What's up, man, Dave? I do, I do like Dave. Yeah, he's, right. he's likeable, isn't he? Yeah, he's really likeable. I think if he was my mate, I'd probably just want to shake him and you know, just give him a bit of a slap sometimes. Yeah. But yeah, but I've asked, I've asked him for a T-shirt. I'm going to wrap What a guy. Top man, Dave. <laughs> uh, there we go, yeah. Put all this sweat on it, yeah. Boy. <laughs> I'm going to be raffling that off with me, uh, Ramy Kilimanjaro for the Steve Prescott Foundation oh, really? in uh, October, October the yeah. 11th. So I'm going to be uh, going to auction off Dave Allen's t shirt. I'm going to show it off, yeah. And tweet us in your bid. That's absolutely ring your neck. There we go, the white rhino. Get that on Twitter in a bit. Get your bids in for it. Top man, Dave Allen. Yeah, I know if he does get on one of the matchroom shows again. And, uh, it's a big fight. I mean, it's not nice to talk about Tom Dallas when he's, he's an option, but where does he, you know, where does he go from here? Do you know, I was thinking about it. If, if, if somebody asked me the question tonight, or if, if it was put to me, I did expect that tonight, if I'm honest. I did, I did think that at some point, I don't think Dave was going to be able to pull his punches or was going to be able to, to carry him. I thought the stoppage would come. And I don't like talking about boxers in terms of what they should or shouldn't do, but I think somebody needs to save Tom Dallas from himself now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, whether that's his corner or whether that's his management. He's up now. Yeah. Nice to see he's up, sitting on his feet. Bill Moran tweeted in, he wants to know the standout fights tonight. You'd have to say probably the, intri the most intriguing one is, is obviously Tyler Good John versus Adam Barker, isn't it? Yeah, it is, and then I think Johnny Coyle and Innocent Anuano, I, I, uh, I think definitely that's a fight as well. Anyway, he's only been stopped a couple of times, and I think out of his 20 odd victories, he's had 20 odd stoppages as well, so. That's one to And of course, John Wayne, but what's John Wayne got left? Yeah, yeah. Just helping him. Just, just having another little minute there in the corner. I think the doctor and his team just want to make sure he's all right before they move in. It wasn't nice for Dave Allen. You know, when Dave Allen did drop him, you could see he was, he was almost yeah. shocking his face as well yeah, straight he away. He surprised himself, wasn't he? 
Calvin Square tweeted in White Rhino, let's be having you the people's champion. Very, very popular fighter. Boxing Badman tweeted in. Said that Dallas and White, Dave Allen didn't seem to be taking it too serious. I think that's fair. I think we whether they had a bit of a gentleman's agreement, they were gonna get four rounds out. And Seven seconds of the third round to your winner by technical count. 